Well, just so you know, at about 4.30 a.m. Detroit time, a nearly 8.0 magnitude earthquake out in the Gulf of Alaska, just southeast of Kodiak, rocked things for a while and tsunami concerns all along the coastline of Alaska in the Gulf of Alaska and then British Columbia down through the United States for concerns of tsunamis three hours after the initial earthquake. So that would be through about eight o'clock on Tuesday morning our time. The concern for some of those tsunamis to not only hit up in Alaska, British Columbia, but also pounding waves possible into the Seattle area and then six hours from the start time. So through about 11 a.m. our time, some tsunami waves down in Hawaii, a possibility. Lots more information still coming in on that. Stay tuned. Back here at home, some spotty showers through the morning hours, a little mix of rain and snow that falls to the ground and does not ice up. Temps are too warm on the surface, but not above ground where we are getting a little bit of that wintry mix. Lesser amounts of moisture in the afternoon. Temps will be falling. The winds picking up southwest 10 to 20 miles an hour and anything this afternoon after two or three o'clock should be snowy and the snow up in parts of the thumb region could stack up to an inch throughout the day on Tuesday north of I 69. Other than that, we see some spotty snow showers through the afternoon, not accumulating, not worried about that but cooler air coming in for your Wednesday. A nice blend of sun and clouds, 20s to low 30s through the day tomorrow and Thursday, which is good stuff here. We've got 33 degrees right on average where we should be. A decent amount of sunshine coming and going, especially Thursday and Friday. And look at the numbers warming back up on Friday as we hit Saturday. Could get a little bit of light rain, maybe changing to a few flakes late in the day Saturday into Sunday.